Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I wanted to share four fragrances that I will definitely be wearing this fall. All of these fragrances are inexpensive and can be found at your local Ross or TJ Maxx. All right, so let's get into the first fragrance. Well, all fragrances can be found at your local Ross or TJ Maxx except for one, but it's also a very inexpensive fragrance. The first fragrance that I will be wearing this fall, also this winter, this is definitely one that I'll be wearing this winter as well, and it is Moonlight by Ariana Grande. I actually got this from Ross for, I wanna say, no more than $25, and it is a great scent. I will put um, the scent notes on the screen because I don't know exactly what they are. But I will just describe the scent and let you guys know what I can smell and what I think about the scent personally. It's definitely a floral scent and it's definitely a sweet scent. So this is like a sweet floral. It's not too much. It's not a... It's not as sweet as like Sweet Like Candy by Ariana or anything like that. It's a more subtle, sweet scent. Perfect for colder weather. Um, I actually bought this perfume a few weeks back and I just was saving it for colder weather. It's not anything that I really wanted to wear while it was very hot outside, but now that it is cooling off, Moonlight by Ariana Grande is definitely going to be one of my go-tos once the weather cools off. It's a perfect standalone scent and it's also a good scent to layer if you are like me and you like to layer your perfumes with your Bath and Body Works scents and stuff like that. This is a good standalone and layering scent. The Lasting Power um I would say this perfume, I know for sure it'll last about four hours. I wore it to church about two weeks ago and I could still smell it when I got home, but I also paired it with some bad, um, I also paired it with the Bath and Body Works fragrance mist and lotion. So yeah, I know you'll get at least four hours out of this scent, but honestly, if it's a scent that I really enjoy, which this one is, I don't have a problem with reapplying, so yeah. The second scent that I will be carrying into the fall and winter months is Fancy by Miss Jessica Simpson. And I have seen this scent all over YouTube. I was at Ross over the weekend and I was so excited when I saw this scent because I hadn't seen it in Ross for months. So I was very excited once I saw this scent in here. And in my opinion, it is definitely worth the hype. This is a very gourmand scent. It's giving like vanilla, caramel, amber, those type of vibes. When I picked up this scent, I remembered that I had the fragrance mist to this in high school, but I had totally forgotten that I had it until I picked it up and smelled it like this smells familiar. But with me saying that it's not a childish scent at all, it's still a good scent for adults. Um, as far as layering, I'm not sure if I would do too much playing with this. Like I may put on like a vanilla scented lotion, but as far as a body spray, I don't think it would be very necessary with this scent because it is potent from me testing it out. It is very potent. I sprayed this on as soon as I came out of Ross and I went shopping in a few more other stores and um, the Ross was like an hour away from my hometown. So I feel like the lasting power on this scent will be very good as well, but I don't think I'll do much playing with this scent. Maybe add like a vanilla lotion, like I said, but this is one of those scents you can strictly do like, you know, some Vaseline in this and you'll be good to go. The next scent that I'll be showing you guys is Malibu by Juicy Couture. This is another scent I found at Ross and I don't think I made, I paid 
more than $25 for this scent as well. So make sure you guys are looking at the scents at Ross. They have some great deals. Although the name, the name of this scent is Malibu. So I was expecting for it to be a um, scent that I would want to wear like in the summer, hence the vibe Malibu. But actually this is not like a scent I would wear on a summer day because it is a, it has a heavy floral note, but it's not like a grandma floral. It's like a sweet floral. I usually run from florals because, you know, I don't want to smell like your grandma, no offense. Like I want to smell like a young woman. So don't get scared because I say floral. This is a sweet, fun floral. Definitely not your granny floral so yeah this is actually a scent that i will enjoy wearing year round i have been wearing it throughout the summer but i know for sure i will be wearing this scent throughout the fall especially the winter like this is giving me winter vibes as well it's a good scent to layer with your um fragrance mist and body creams and stuff like that so yeah scent number three is malibu by Juicy Couture. The last scent that I have is one of my all time favorites. I only have the travel size of this right now. I don't have the larger bottle, but I have been wearing this scent since college, literally. And it smells so, so good. Like it's, this is Teased by Victoria's Secret, but it's also a year round scent. I'm not really drawn to this in the summer. However, you could wear it throughout the summer months, but I just know this is gonna smell so good throughout the winter months. And what I'm getting from this is like a sweet, like, I don't know, it's just like sweet and sexy. I'm not getting a floral note from it. It's just pretty much giving like sweet and sexy, but not too sweet, not like a childish sweet, like a grown and sexy sweet. So yeah, I have to get a bigger bottle of this because the rollerball, um, I like it for travel, but I prefer a spray because I can put on more of it at once. But yes, this is definitely going to be one of my go-to perfumes for the colder months as well. I hope you guys enjoyed this perfume video. If you would like to see more fragrance videos from me, whether it's body mist or perfumes, just give this video a thumbs up or leave me a comment. If you made it to this point in the video, you should definitely consider subscribing. Um, all right. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye.